we have arrived in Bogota, Colombia and we've just um, rented a apartment by Airbnb so we'll just give you a little bit of a tour so this is the toilet and shower, decent shower then and then you come into a kitchenette area all the mud cons, enough space to, to cook a small meal computer area there for Kieran table and chairs and a sofa which I thought was a sofa bed but it's just a sofa and then you've got a sink area here and a little pizza room to the shower and then way up the stairs and we've got this mezzanine floor the 42 inch TV and a humongous bed which I think is like maybe a super super king size or something yeah so good price about 280 odd pounds for two weeks just finish the video just arrived at Zona Rosa which is recommended as a, an area of places to leave so we're just going to go and check it out somewhere there place for you Kieran, put your tills It's supposed to be a place to we have not seen very many places to we. I mean, we don't know how far down it goes. Like, is it the beginning of it? Is it the middle? Is it? We have no idea. We're going in blind on this one. Wow! Do you like the fact shopping mall or something? Yeah, shopping mall. Yep. I feel, I feel a bit weird because I'm going like this. I forget that I've got to turn. I forget that I've got to turn. It'd be good if it had a little swivelling mm. thing on it. There's a shopping centre there. Bike place there. Oh, there we go, McCarthy's Irish Pub coming up there on the right. Seen a few Irish pubs here, they must like the Irish pubs. And I bet there'll be like one thing in there that's Irish again. Well, like the one in Mexico where they had like a couple of Irish whiskies, canned Guinness, and the rest was. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but the fort was there though. like a supermarket Here we are 
called Zona Rosa. Really cool, quirky bar there. Oh, is that another menu for that? No menu. That looks like a German bar, maybe. Da piano. Italian brand, yeah, they like their Italian. Eh? Yeah, this is, this is the official Why the fuck do you know, I mean, the, the, that's probably an overspill of the area though, isn't it? Club Columbia there. They love their Italian too, don't they? Barra, Chalala, la, la something. Beer plates. It says it's food, which it, it is, but it mainly feels like this is the drinking area as well. El Irish. Well, L is the, I think. So it's the Irish. One burgers. A hair club over there. for a place to drink, I think a Zona Rosa could be the one.
El el sol. Eh, okay. Here, here you can appreciate an example of the thousand that we have. Uh, most of the fruits from Colombia they are sport as well. This one is lulo, very exotic fruit. You're gonna have this one as well that is called guanabana. It's the most healthy fruit that you can eat in your life, for real. Uh, it's antioxidant. This one, if you can try, I recommend it. It's only they spend one year to grow and you only can have it in this month that's it after that it's difficult until next year you will find it and that's from the coast for a home mm. it's aphrodisiac um, <laughs> and Pleho, we're gonna have this one as well this stuff Purua as well actually if you want it you can have a juice here but it's your decision this market as well have a lot of restaurants if you would like to have lunch when we finish Seen that? Is that, is that star fruit? Is star fruit correct? Yeah. So we have to wait. Uh, that's the family. They are cousins. Ah. Yeah. This looks like a tomato. Uh, do you want to try it? Very leathery though. Well, I, I wouldn't know where to begin. I guess you peel it like an orange. Yeah. Mm. 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 So, this one is the tallest building in Bogota and Colombia. It's called Bacata, and Bacata is the name of this area. It's an indigenous world. And we knew that this was perfect. When the Spanish came, we took Santa Fe, Bogota, and now it's called Bogota. Just in Bogota town, we've got a church there. Don't know what it's called. Or is it a cathedral? Looks like a cathedral. And I think they're getting ready for Christmas. There's Christmas decorations around. And this looks like a local Sunday market. Got jewelry there. They've got the usual handbag type things. Some sort of local oh, bees. It's kind of get past the bees then. Are they all stimmy? Ow, ow, ow. Stony machine. This is uh, just the town centre. Oh, did you all see that? Just off for lunch out here, yep. and we're hoping for Tepin Yankee, but glad to see this open. <coughs> Camera's on, so uh, we are at Mount Monserrat. Is it? Thousand meters, don't you? Yeah, it's gone to my head a little bit. We're now four and a four thousand six hundred meters high. Which I think is about four thousand six hundred meters. We 
evacuation room. It's a bit late for that. So we're coming up to the uh, church there. So what's here, Kieran? It's a church, it's a crucifix, sanctuary. Yeah, got it. I think there's a restaurant somewhere. Yeah. I feel like that now. <laughs> Nice green area. You definitely get some good views of the city on the way up here. This is the tourist trap markets, really. <laughs> Always are in these places, as we get to top of somewhere and they've got the usual tourist stuff. That's giving me a bit of a headache going here. Well, why don't you try to do what you told me to do? We'll get some tiger bombs yeah. to get over a fucking bowl and see how you do. I mean, to be fair, I did overdo the tiger bomb. I no shit. I did. I could. I could. When I went out and came back in, I thought oh, that's all I got in the room. Hello. So if you want your tourist stuff, you've got your tourist stuff here. I feel the locals wear jumpers and hats and gloves. And we're like, what, <laughs> what can we wear less of? Yeah. Did you like to eat the green something? Hello. 
Papi, son 3.000. Bienvenidos ¿Oíste? a Tumbar con Vista al Mar. ¿Otro? So maybe this is what they mean by restaurant, restaurants. Has anything grabbed you or not, Simone? Hmm? Has anything grabbed you? Back grab for me. Whiskey. <laughs> Mark, come back. Alright. I'm pretty sure it was there that had the barrel that said whiskey on it. Alright. Again, shame we've not got a cafeteria, but okay. Oh, what's this? Coco Ron. Do you speak English? Yeah, I speak English. If you want to break, I can give you the try. Coco Ron, Coco. That's tell you twice. Nope. I'm tempted by that purely because I just like the fire and the gun. <laughs> the gun's going to cause you more. No, I think it's, it's, right. it's just a light talking. I thought you were quitting smoking. I don't encourage you to carry on smoking. These have 25 cigars? Yeah. 25 cigars. That's cheap. That's very cheap. Look at Ron. Is 34% of alcohol, or we have in a water. Is that that one? Yeah. And the other is a guardiente, that a guardiente is typical alcohol in Colombia. That's nice, that's smooth. <laughs> but you don't drink spirit straight. <laughs> no. You don't like it? <laughs> and what's this one? And this is a guardiente. It's different, it's like a guarantee that typical I call in Colombia. Mm -hmm. in English, like, I want. Yeah, I was pressing the wrong button. <laughs> so, got views here again. Okay, see if I can climb. I'm sure how you get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, house for you there. Yeah, because I can see Jesus. The same thing that's on uh, above Rio de Janeiro. You know, the... Yeah. I 
like you're in that room with Coke. We can have one with Coke. I'm letting you have it all. I can sense a rubbing cigar now coming. Probably tonight, knowing you. A little bit of a sneaky peek of a view here as well. Try not to break your neck. Whoop. 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 Little, little snippet view of Bogota there. Oh, horse, babe. That's what you'd probably ride. Hello horsey horsey. So uh, yeah, nice being.